Uh, morning, Doug. Not too late for breakfast, am I? No, of course not, actually. I was hoping I might pick your brains. <laughs> OK, but I'll warn you now, it'll be slim pickings. <laughs> <laughs> very good, very good. <laughs> I'm here all week. <laughs> and it's a pleasure having you. Now, I don't know if I've told you about my gardening flock. Uh, you might have mentioned it, yeah. It's very popular in Japan. <laughs> and I've been thinking I'd introduce a short DIY section. Oh, good for you. Yeah. And good for the fans, of which I have quite a few. Uh, right, uh, I look forward to watching it then. <laughs> I was hoping you might be in it. A sort of DIY sidekick broadened my core audience. Uh, I'm flattered, obviously, but <coughs> I don't think I'm I up knew to it. you were the man for the job. Fans are going to love you. Not straight away, obviously. The key is to relax. Just be yourself. Yeah. Doug, you've got one of the best collections of tools I've ever seen. Really? You think so? All immaculate, too. You know what I think? What? I think you don't need me, and your fans don't either. Diggy Duggy's the star of the show here. Apart from this lot. You haven't even given it a shot yet. Oh, sorry. Um, I'm, I'm just leaving, love, sorry. Dad, uh... What in love? What is it? You're all right. I can't do it. I've left him. Oh! You OK? Yeah, just trying to envisage it, looking anything other than a wreck. Hello? Hi. Can I help you? I'm the owner. Oh, Mr. Katechia. That's right. Neville Crosby, we spoke on the phone. Yeah, from the insurance company, right? That's right. As you know, I'll be leading the investigation into the uh, fire at the property, alongside the police and fire departments, of course. Any news? Uh, a couple of things have come to light which I'd like to raise with you. Would now be a convenient time? Sure. Firstly, we notice that an upstairs chimney breast at some point has been removed, rather inexpertly, too. Yeah, I'm afraid I can't help you there. I mean, any work like that was carried out long before we bought the place. I suspected as much. Not to worry. And the other thing... Oh, yes, we found the property to be infected with dry rot. Dry rot? You sure about that? Oh, without a doubt. You didn't know. I had no idea. I mean, I'm not even sure I'd know what I was looking for. I see. OK. Well, is it important? Should we be worried? As I said when we spoke on the phone, there's still a good deal of investigative work to undertake. But we'll be in touch once we know more. Think about what he said. So she'd pick up the pace on his investigation. So you're not worried about this dry rot? You know what? I think he must have been mistaken. Really? Sounds like he knew what he was talking about. I've been looking online. Seriously? Dry rot can be pretty serious. Priya. I've had two lots of builders in there, and this is the first time I've heard anything about any dry rot. Trust me, it'll be something and nothing. Well, it doesn't sound like that. Said he's going to be investigating further. When they do, they realise they were wrong. Kids started that fire. It was arson, regardless of any so-called dry rot. It's just you know, I have to give him Kieran that 20,000. You can hardly afford for anything else to go wrong. And it won't. Trust me. 